this is uh, again moving south now towards Foy. So this is Foy Crossroads. And instead of heading straight on, which would take me in about five kilometres into um, Bastoin, turn to left, turn on Foy, left. Then turn. Which, um, thank you, Miss Miss uh, GPS. And this is towards Bisroy. I think you pronounce it. Brothers, famously the E Company, but in the woods overlooking, whoops, overlooking Foy, and right in front of us are the woods overlooking Foy. So where is a combine harvester? I can't see the screens. I'm not sure what what you can see now, but those woods past the electrical pylons are the ones. The company looked from. I'm going to take a walk in them again. Because their foxholes are located right at the very edge of that wood. Oh, there's something going on up here. Oh, farms at work. Tourists like me going to visit. That is a wide vehicle. Oh, that's, a front of, that's the back end of the car. Oh, oh, so right. Oh, yes. Once again, those woods are kind of like fingers. So the second one along, I think, is where they were. The other thing to point out is that the Germans were actually located to the left of us, so this as well. So the woods to the left were held partly by the Germans, and the Americans had foxholes, which you can't see on the very edge of this road going up this hill. So now I'm coming this way, I might as well go all the way down the hill. Um, so, as I say, this is the so the front lines were behind me. And unless I've got my bearings wrong, there should be a memorial to the uh, first. Just in front of us. Yep. It's a tourist attraction. There's another car park there. So just behind these trees on the right hand side. This is the uh, memorial to the 506th Parachute Infantry Regiment, 101st Airborne Division E Company. And there's a lovely motif with the traditional uh, emblem of a, a dead soldier with a, his gun in the ground and his helmet on the top, on the butt. Move the camera a little bit. There's the names of those that um, died here. So some of them are familiar. AP Heron. Poplar, Kenneth Webb, Earl of Webb, Pinkala, Muck. So they're all from December and um, December 44, January 45. And the woods they were in are that way. Last time I was here, this was um, on barren ground, if I remember. 
But here's a new sign, I've only just noticed as I was getting back in the car. Borjacks. Jack's Wood Band of Brothers. So and it's asking people, I presume it says uh, no campaign. I think it's basically asking people not to um, figure the area. The Men and the Easy Company Foundation. Hmm.